Last week, we again initiated another interaction to make better understanding of powerful questions. So, if a scrum master approaches you and asks that my team is not interested in continuing with daily scrum, what would you do or what kind of question as an agile coach you will ask your scrum master? Now, there are options and there are polls which can show you that what kind of questions community is thinking of of asking. My opinion is the poll which got maximum vote is not the appropriate question to ask. Now if you ask have you explained the importance of daily scrum to your team it means you are undermining the, the knowledge and competency of your scrum master. It's more like a suggestion rather than a question that go and explain about scrum meeting to your team. Now you may end up doing this if your team is at a very beginning stage and your scrum master is very very new. But in general in other spaces we should rely that scrum master can understand about scrum and about their team and we should believe in his capability of solving that particular problem or that particular issue. Now if you start relying on scrum masters capability what could be the question. In my opinion the last option which talks about what will your team gain from not doing the daily scrum is a good starting question. So the idea is whenever somebody is coming up with, with a dilemma or with a goal, it's better to ask questions related to pains and gains. So whatever you want to do, what will you get out of it and what all you will miss because of doing this. So the questions which makes pain gains visible generates better insights. And this particular question is focusing on, okay, I understand your team wants to discontinue doing daily scrum. What are you planning to gain? Or what are you thinking you will gain by doing it? Now, once the gain answer comes in, there is a probability I may start asking about the pain related to not doing daily scrum. I may start asking that, okay, what will your team miss by not doing daily scrum? And depending upon the answer, I may end up asking to judge what the scrum master is thinking that do you think it is the right thing to do for your team. And I think these three questions should give me or give a sufficient insights to the scrum master to find out what is appropriate or how he should approach this particular situation with his own uh, uh, team. This is like is your team trained well in a scrum is again a question which is, which is more like yes no which is more like collecting information and becoming a doctor uh, 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 for a problem rather than a coach for a problem. What is your opinion? You can comment about your opinion related to this question or any other question in this particular video.